I can do this all day. At least all night, right? Oh, yeah. Hey, oh. Oh, hey, Michael here from Beer Baseball Blog, The Adventures of Craft Beer and Baseball. This is the Beer Baseball Blogcast, episode 43 for February 23rd, 2021. Wherever you are watching us live today, please give us a like and a comment. Let us know that you're out there. As always, we'd appreciate if you subscribe and turn on those notifications. A shout out to our Patreon supporters, Jason Schaefer. Thank you so much. We appreciate your support. Cowboy Jack Durango, the cleanup hitter. And uh, he is in the comments. He is uh, oh, waiting. Man. Hello, 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 hello. Hello, hello. <laughs> Guess who? Guess who? If you would like to be a Patreon subscriber and support the Beer Baseball blog and the Beer Baseball blogcast, the Hoppy Hour, um, you might even be considered to be on one of our Hoppy Hours. Uh, we're uh, currently reviewing that right now. Check out our uh, Patreon page at Beer Baseball. We also have an eBay page uh, that supports uh, not only us, but the uh, Support Fibromyalgia Network. Um, we give the pro some of the proceeds to them as well. Um, we have an Etsy page, which actually a uh, big teach 45 just went on and bought some stuff. And I threw in uh, a couple extra goodies in there. Thank you for all the support. And uh, yeah, so that's the, uh, that's the, uh, that's the plugs right now at the top of the hour. And uh, here is the lineup card for today. Please welcome the VP of content development at the beer baseball blog, Angela Trinidad. Welcome. Hey, Michael. Hey, Kevin. Hey, everyone. Thank you guys for tuning in. Episode 43. Hard to believe that we've been at it for almost a year. And a fun fact on my Facebook memory, we talked, uh, gosh, it must have been a couple months ago now about the last, the, one of the fun facts was the last baseball game we attended uh, live. And a memory popped up that the last baseball game I attended in person was actually uh, uh, one year ago yesterday, which was a uh, Aliso Viejo Little League, Double A Red Sox, uh, and uh, one of the three only three games that they played last season. So, oh, that was such a shame when I when I heard that. An another season that got wiped out by by all of this. Uh, so yeah. sad. So sad. Next, he is the field correspondent and senior research analyst at the Bear Baseball Blog. Kevin Lyon, welcome. Good evening, everybody. Excited, ready to have some good beer and open up some pack of cards. Yeah, it's it's going to be a fun one. Uh, before we get into it, um, and before I uh, check the uh, comments, I wanted to uh, make mention of someone um, who supported us uh, by sending us a letter, and I definitely wanted to uh, uh, show this. So I got this letter uh, in uh, in our at our PO box, oh, wow. and uh, I'd like to read it if I uh, if I can. I, I'll, well, I'll try it to skim says through on the it. Top, if possible, please read on stream. Well, there you yeah. go. There you go. So, um, <laughs> Mike, this is a gift for you. Uh, just to say thank you uh, so, so much for doing uh, these amazing po live podcasts. Uh, uh, it says every night, but I, I we do not do it every night. We do it every Tuesday. <laughs> uh, hopefully, we can do it uh, one time hey, uh, every hey, night. Hey, but That'd you know, there is... Carvers and Creators every Thursday at 4 p.m. Pacific. That's right. I, I am quickly filling up. I have another uh, podcast that I'm starting up to um, and oh possibly goodness. be on Clubhouse as well, as if I have an extra minute. Um, but I, I'm doing that as well. But um, I hope you uh, know how much uh, me and the rest of the Beer Baseball blog fans appreciate these awesome podcasts. So awesome. Thank you for that. Um, you got, uh, To Kevin and Angelo, you guys are amazing too. A huge highlight of my day is sitting down um, with a soda because I'm not 21 uh, and watching three friends talk about the best sport ever created and some of the cool and amazing history behind it. Now, he actually uh, put in two uh, extra things, which was uh, he says the, the, the gift is an autograph of legendary Cardinals manager, Whitey Herzog. Wow. Wow. Yes. So that, that, I mean, as a Cardinal fan, uh, watching the, the white rat, 
uh, Whitey Herzog, uh, you know, he uh, took the Cardinals to the 80, what was it? 80, Did he take, I think he, series. yeah, he took him to all three of the World Series yeah. in the 80s. Yes. Uh, winning one in 82. Um, uh, Hall of Famer Whitey Herzog as well. He gave us a $10 donation plus the card. Um, again, we have the best fan. So thank you so much for uh, watching us uh, faithfully every week. This has been a blast. And and uh, obviously we don't do it for any, any of these gifts or anything, but it, it was a thrill to get that in the mail and That's see really, really nice. how, how we affect it, everybody. Awesome. And I wanted right to the give- PC. Right into the PC. I love oh, it. Oh, yes, for sure. So um wanted to give a shout out. This is from Andrew. And Andrew, you can find Andrew um, on Instagram uh, at Sports Cards uh, Heaven and uh, on YouTube at uh, Daily Sports Talk. And you'll probably see him in the uh, in the comments here. So that yeah. was super cool. So that's really nice of him to do that. Yeah, you have, yeah I, I remember I mentioned I won a couple packs of cards for, in a contest that he did uh, at Thanksgiving time. So that's nice. I, might, I think I still might have one in my grab bag. Oh, that's that's super cool. So, so thank you again, Andrew. Uh, we really appreciate you watching. Um, uh, Ed is in the chat. Uh, Cowboy Jack Durango, uh, uh, David. Godman. Yeah, and uh, there he is. Uh, there Daily he Sports is. Talk, Boston. There he is. Um, yeah, Bubble Pug watching us again tonight. All of his podcast. Um, Chad M. Thank you so much for joining yeah. us. Uh, right. My buddy, now this is awesome. My buddy Kevin Ziegler is here. Um, thank you for watching, Kevin. Kevin sent me an, uh, a care package as well. And um, there, I'm actually going to be doing uh, not only a video on the stuff that he sent me, uh, but I'm also going to be featuring some Arizona beers. Uh, right. And they're from Kevin. So thank you so much. Kevin. This, uh, w- this, is, this is amazing. This is a, a community effort. Uh, you know, we love doing this and we, we're really glad that everybody likes uh, likes watching it. I mean, we would be in an empty room if it wasn't for all you guys. So thank you so much. Uh, who else is in here? Uh, yeah, uh, Colin Duncan. Thank you for oh, yeah, joining. Yeah. Um, uh, uh, I think I think there's some uh, there's some other uh, talk in the chat, which I, I, I can't, I, I can't I, keep I, up oh with. Oh my gosh! I may have to have my YouTube on in the background just so I can watch the banter. Yeah. Um, oh yeah. Here, uh, no, I'm not going to sell this one. This is going in my no, PC. Not no not, not the not the not the baseball store. So. Um, but thank you. Oh, and 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 thank you, Kevin. We we appreciate it very thank much. You, uh, so let's get into it right away. Um, what are you drinking tonight? Let's oh, start out with uh, Kevin Lyon. Oh, he started with me. Hey, yeah. look at that! I took that photo. Yes, you so did. So we talk about Radiant Beer Company a lot, <clears throat> mainly me because it literally is about half a mile from where I live. So I'm walking by there a lot. And Saturday morning. They post a little story on Instagram saying, surprise, we have a new IPA that came out today. And I'm like, well, I guess I'm going to stop by there and grab a four pack of that for the show. So there it is. And here it is. It's a hazy IPA. You can see the haze. Look at that. Haze. What's it called? Ooh, it looks amazing. It's called Hope Like Fire. And I don't really have much info on it because I literally, when I um, checked in on Untapped, I was the first person to put in a review on Untapped. Oh, so I, you. I, I, and I didn't get, and I just got home. So I didn't get a chance to really, uh, Go to their iGram page to give you more info. I don't know if you got a chance. I was mostly senior research analyst. I didn't do my job. <laughs> <laughs> and I'm like, oh, can I find it really fast? Probably not. Because literally they just mentioned on Instagram. I don't think they made a formal post about it yet. Yeah. This I, is really I, nice. I caught a little bit of information from it. It's a uh, 6.6 ABV. Yeah. Um, it's considered a, a New England IPA. So uh, hazy, yeah. uh, hazy IPA with Citra and Nelson hops. Thank you. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah. So, um, yeah, I'm, I'm, yeah, I'm this is like their third hazy. I believe this is their second hazy IPA. And they also had the hazy pale ale forward motion that I had last week on the show and their hazes have been really good. Well, everything's been really good. You know, <laughs> even the styles that are not my favorite, I really enjoyed what they've done with them so far. Yeah. It's some good stuff. Good stuff. And, uh, we love radiant beer. I can't wait yeah. to get out there and, uh, sit on that patio and take a picture like you just did right there, Kevin. So <laughs> yeah, I think um, that's what I at the counter. I went to the counter and said, Hey, give me one of these. <laughs> there you <laughs> go. Nicely done. Yeah. And I'm already norm over there almost. <laughs> yeah. you. <laughs> yeah. No one's yeah, going to know that. They're my age. <laughs> <laughs> What's the good word, Mr. Peterson. Yes. Yeah, right. Um, all right, Angelo, what do you got tonight? <laughs> All right, so tonight I'm going to be drinking uh, St. Archer Brewing Company's Hazy IPA. This one's 6.2 ABV, 48 IBU, so right around my wheelhouse for IBU. Uh, This one's described uh, as hazy, full-bodied, juicy, low bitterness, 
This beer has all the desired traits of a New England style IPA. We fermented this beer using London Three Yeast, giving it a soft, easy look with mosaic, citra, azaka, and galaxy hops added in the whirlpool. And the dry hop, this beer is straight juice without the pulp. So cheers, boys. Yeah, yeah. nicely done. Um, Come on. Did you ever go to the St. Archer? Uh, they had a place. It was in right field yes. at Angel Stadium. Did you Did you ever go there, Angelo? Yeah. So um, I ate there for my birthday in 2000, That's right. 2018. What's really cool about that about St. Archer is uh, so there's two dining time slots. There's 5 mm-hmm. p.m. and 7 p.m. So essentially BP or the game. And we went to the five o'clock, so because we had really good seats actually that game because it was my birthday. So, um, but uh, they have um, a rotating menu uh, depending on uh, what uh, who they're playing against. So I went against the Royals, so they had a Kansas City barbecue inspired um, menu. Oh, right on! And it was really, nice. it was really, really great. Yeah, I had they had um, it was um, uh, ribs, uh, smoked sausage. And uh, barbecue ch- Kansas City barbecue chicken, which is like a dry rub uh, chicken uh, with uh, with jasmine sticky rice. It was really really good. I can imagine. So, uh, so once uh, once uh, things open back up, I definitely encourage you guys if you're in SoCal to check out St. Archer. It's uh, by reservation only, um, but uh, check it out. It's super awesome. Yeah. yeah. Michael and I got lucky. We just happened to walk over there, check it out, and then we got in. <laughs> yeah, I think it was awesome. the just, of the game, and they're like, well, "Yeah," we we're like, "What is this?" It, it must have been a yeah, weekday think, game. How the hell we could have got in? Yeah, I think they they advertise it as reservation only because it's on the club level. So yeah, technically, you either need to have reservations that you're going to go there for sure, or sitting in the club level to just just yeah. in. I but yeah, I want to say fun. now you can go straight to that area without having to go through the ushers. I think one of the ramps oh, okay. to the ushers like leads right to like an entrance. Yeah. There. If you, if you keep on it's going elevator. and like, like you're going to the outfield. Yeah. 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 I think there's an elevator that goes straight there. Right. right. Maybe that's where it was. Think about it. Yeah. Yeah. And they had an exclusive beer only to that stadium, right? It was the same. Yeah. Didn't we have that with Kevin? It was yes. Like I, Angel I can't something. remember the name of it right now, but it was like, yeah. a, it was, I want to say it was a Pilsner. But it had a, it, it was like I remember had like a, where it's black versus the IPA. It was red. It was something angels really, but I can't recall. I'd have to like. Yeah, I, I'm trying to remember too, but I can't. Yeah, they, they, did, they only had it like back in the 2018 season, from what I recall, because I think by 2019 they didn't have it. And I'm guessing it it opened up in 2018, maybe 2017, but the latest 2018 is when it opened. Yeah, up. it used to be what it, the whole club. Is that what it was called before? Yeah, but that was like that whole area. I don't think was able to be accessible to the public at all. Yeah. Yeah. So, but so the unit, it was a good idea because I'm there's I'm sure other parks have something similar to that. So it's a good touch for the angels to do that. Yep. And uh, my beer tonight oh, yeah. is the Mayberry Ooh. IPA from El Segundo Brewing. Uh, if you're familiar with the uh, Stone Cold Steve Austin, uh, they that's the same brewery that does that. Uh, this is a West Coast IPA uh, with Mosaic, Cascade, and Chinook hops. Uh, I, anything that comes from El Segundo is is awesome i i haven't had a bad beer from them yet um and uh yeah it says it's actually i didn't and i didn't know this that um it's actually uh let's see it's it, it the description of it is it's like it's a, in, it's perfect for enjoying it on a sunny day on main street um affectionately known as mayberry by the sea so that oh, okay. el segundo thing that yeah. would make sense and uh but i've never been down there so i i'm not familiar with I, uh I this. don't recall if they're on Main Street or not because I remember it was like in that general area. Because it's a cool little downtown area to walk around once everything opens. Because there's like a cool tiki bar over there. There's an old, old, old like movie theater where they show like silent movies like on the weekends. So that's I was like, oh, there's some fun stuff just to check out if you wanted to walk around the area. And obviously, that was going to have a really good product. Gotcha. Uh, 7.2 uh, ABV. I did not see uh, an IBU on it. Um, but yeah, this is is, is taste um, you know very very West Coast beer ish yeah. and and uh, definitely in our in our wheelhouse. So we'll definitely have to make it down to El Segundo. Um, yeah. uh, hopefully this year. Yeah, this is a year round release, but I somehow I don't think I've ever had it. I, I, I always see it, but I just never gotten around to trying it. Yeah, it, it's really it, it's really juicy and and really good. All right, so let's get into it. This is round two of baseball card pack wars. We are going for twenty twenty one. 
uh, series one. And uh, last week, um, you know, Kevin uh, stayed on top. So yeah, we, we had some low numbers. Now we have some pretty high numbers here. Yep. Um, Angelo, I mean, um, not that far out. And, um, and even though uh, Angelo, you went 16 and 37 last week, uh, I went 20 and 33 and Kevin went uh, 17 and 36. Yeah. So um, actually, uh, yeah, I didn't realize that I, I actually did the best, but I did not make any, yeah. uh, you, you actually but, got some high ones, Kevin. And at the yeah, end, well, that's how I was going to say, if Angelo, Angelo got like, like a, a, a big number at the end, but otherwise yeah, he would have, really I got. think it was the 12. Yeah. You got yeah. 12. So I remember what it was you got. Yeah. You got the biggest one of the day. Yeah. And uh, so these are the uh, pack wars uh, rules. Uh, I'm not going to go through them. Uh, we're in, in this, uh, yeah, we're just going to go for a uh, high card um, uh, of, of our packs. And uh, so let me uh, stop my screen. I'm actually going to share. Let me uh, open Let's get that randomizer bit. ready. Yeah, we got to get the randomizer. So let me get rid of that. Here we go. And here we go. So share screen. I wish we had some uh, interlude the, music. Yeah, I'll guess. What is your state college? Is that the is that uh, state college spikes? Yeah, this is this is uh, state college spikes. It, it used to be the um, a uh, a ball for the Cardinals, but it's no longer. It's it's um, I, I can't remember what league it's in now. But uh, it's funny when my when my girlfriend first got me a Cardinals uh, shirt. Uh, for like my birthday or Christmas or something like that. I think she, she thought she was getting like a St. Louis Cardinals, but she got the state college spikes, which was a ball. And I was so impressed. I'm like, how do you, how did you get an a ball shirt? And I'm going, that's really impressive. And she goes, I did. <laughs> she didn't even know. So it's like, uh, it was, it was kind of funny, but uh, yeah, I, I yeah, love that. I, yeah. Is that Pennsylvania? I'm guessing. Uh, state college, and that's a good question. Um, I, I, I was thinking like Penn State area or something like that because I, I don't really know of teams that were out there or not. I have to, I can look it up while you're getting that ready. Yeah, yeah, definitely try to look it up. And, and I and I think that they're in. They kind of melded into another league. A whole bunch I know of like state college PA, so maybe that's what it was. State that college. that might be it. And I think that the there's a new league out there. I think like the Clinton Lumber Kings and all those other oh, teams you know that what? didn't get actually, affiliations. They are actually um, one of those summer leagues. They're a collegiate summer baseball. That's team. that's what it is. Yeah, they became part of that. Yeah, yeah, they're in the MLB draft league, and yeah, they play at State College PA. So that's like the uh, yeah on Penn State. So they actually play at the Penn State uh, field. So there gotcha. You go. Okay, perfect. Thank you. Yeah, it's kind of hard to keep up with uh, where all the teams landed, but yeah, uh, we'll get there. All right, so let's roll the dice uh, to see uh, what order we're going to go in. So I'm going to roll the dice, and we got a six. So here is uh, nine selections. So we're going right. to randomize this. Uh, did I say six times? Yep. Yes. Uh, six. Let's do it. One, two, two, two three, three, four. I'm a ref. I got to count to five. Five. And six. Ooh, the wild cards are right in the middle. So let me right. uh, copy that. Okay, and we're going to paste that right there. And then now we're going to go to, we're going to roll oh, the dice again. Points. So we're going to do the points now. So nine rounds. Um, and so there we go. We got uh, four. So we're going to randomize this four times. There's all the numbers. So one, two, three, and four. All right. Oh, so. Not very high on the wild cards there. All right. Okay. So here we go. Okay. So the, yeah, the wild cards. Okay. So that's two. That's all, another one. Uh, so we did, we did a two and then this one will be six. Oh, so <laughs> we're not going to have as high a point total this week. That's yeah. So right. only 49 possible points um, available right now. So um, let's. Go back to this and right. go fill this up. Right. There we go. All right. Who wants to go first? Who's in the lead? Who's in that the lead? Be... Kevin's in the lead. So you go first, buddy. All righty. Let's see. We got tops 21, 2021. All nine packs today are going to be these. Did we use our box topper pack last week? Yep. With that beautiful Hank Aaron card that Angelo got. 
Yeah. All right. Let's see. We're going to start off here with Mitch Moreland. Uh, this guy, Mr. Trout. Uh, Shane Bieber. Matthew Boyd. Get your beers ready, ladies and gentlemen, Eric Sogard. Yeah. All right. Starting good. I made sure I grabbed two of these, so I hope I finish these. So this first inning is worth two points. All righty. We have um, Malik Smith. Brandon Crawford. Chris Paddock. Steven Matz. Uh, let's see my, so I think this is actually considered a rainbow one. Cause I didn't see anything about saying silver, but this is the, the, uh, foil, the yeah. Rangers card. Yeah. Yep. Foil. So, okay. Yeah. It's rainbow foil. Right. Okay. I don't, I don't, it might be, it might be just regular, regular foil. I have to figure it out. Cause it says something about rainbow foil. I was going through the list. I'm like, that's the only thing that looked like it matched Uh Baltimore Orioles team card. <laughs> so this is funny. The regular Texas Rangers team card. Nice. Oh, wow. So that's, that's interesting. And so didn't you get like two of the same cards in one of your like wrestling packs or something? Two Bojo Raleigh's. There you go. Uh, oh gosh. I'm sorry. Joey Wendell <laughs> and um, get up the Mets stars celebrate. Get up, get up, the get, get, All right. get down. 911 is a joke in your town. <laughs> All right. <laughs> so Angelo, why don't you go next? All right. I was seeing that the, I, you uh, people, the viewers are having trouble hearing my audio. Has that cleared up, guys out there? In yeah, the chat? I we're we're gonna get Angela some uh, better audio because the I think it's the phone and the. Did you have the um? The, I, the, I had your, the pot in, but I in. took it out. Yeah, I took gotcha. It out. So yeah, I think good. so. All right, so we're gonna kick things off. Anthony Santander, Hunter Harvey, Danny Mendick. Okay, Cowboy Jack said it's better now. Good. All right. Yeah, it sounds fine better now. Was, I think it was the AirPod because I was having issues with that in some of the early shows too. Mike Clevenger. Danny Santana. Uh, Miguel Andujar. Nelson Cruz. Get your beers ready for Yelly. All right. Oh, yeah. Yelly, yelly, yelly. Good stuff. Uh, we have a Platinum Players uh, die cut. Uh, Ooh, oh, cool. Banks. Nice. That's another Is one that of those first die cut? I think so. Man, you've had the best. You've been like at a really good box here so far. You know, yeah, I mean, got Relic and that. It's like good. Yeah, and the Hank Aaron yeah. card. Future Kevin Zick Brendan McKay. Kevin Ziegler started out the the, the telecast today uh, with said Let's Play Two, and you got that Ernie Banks. Yeah. You, oh, perfect. Tyler Chatwood. I'm hoping to drink two today. <laughs> Ronald Acuna. Yuli Gurriel. And running it out with Ian Kennedy. Right. Nice. All right. What you got? For right. One? Let's do it. Let's do it. So we still have uh, Kevin and I still have a relic or autograph out there. Yes. You got your relic already. Last I did. Uh, the very first pack. <laughs> yeah. Uh, Heimer uh, Candelaria. Uh, Ryan uh, Castellani. Oh, yeah, I haven't even heard any of these names. Uh, Nick Heath, another, another guy. <laughs> no, no, how do I these how not heard these? The RC on there. These guys might be rookies. I guess so. Tristan McKenzie, another, yeah, another rookie. Oh, he, I remember this guy. Look how skinny he is. He's mm -hmm. like, Gosh, he's yeah. super skinny. Yeah, I remember that. I remember him playing, actually. Uh, Miguel Andahar, uh, another Nelson Cruz. Get your beers ready. We have uh, Christian oh. Yellich. So I think I have a little bit of the pack that Angelo had. Yelly, yelly, yelly. Yep. Uh, Chris Taylor. Uh, let's see. The, the Juan that Soto. All the home plate in that one game in the World Series. All right. Juan Soto. Uh, nice. Oh, wait. Is that it? What's Check that? that one Soto. Is he the kill card? Oh, no, the it's kill it's card. it's the um yeah it's an it's the batting leaders, oh. not the kill card. All right, uh, Brady Singer, Alex Verdugo, 
And my last one is a relic of Glaber Torres. Nice. That's a nice one. So, um, I mean, it's only... uh, so it's only uh I'm gonna I'm gonna I have to knock out Kevin just big even though it's two points. Already. Yeah. All right. So and by now the way, it's down to me and Angelo to see who has high cards. Just to show you that you might have made the right call. 315. Was wow. Really you had, is that what you had? Brandon Crawford was 315. Ooh. So you might this is like that old like NFL commercials. You make the call. <laughs> Mine is Anthony Santander, 320. Oh. See, oh, maybe you didn't make the right call. Let's see. But I think Mike pulled that. I don't know. Oh. oh. What? You had 320? Oh, come on. 319. Oh, oh yeah. <laughs> Super earned that two points. Let's go. <laughs> I laughed because I was like, oh, yeah, 315. There's 330 cards. You both beat me. That's pretty impressive. That's so Nicely that's, done. That, good Angelo. There. Hey, wins a win. Well, and to remind it. everybody, there is 330 cards in this series, and I mentioned Juan Soto. That, I believe, is 330. Yeah. Yes. Because I, Angelo, I think, got that last week. All right. Angelo, so, uh, this is inning two. Uh, this is worth seven points. Okay. Ooh, all right. Let me, let me get that done. All right. At least this was out in my pack before uh, I got kicked out. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I, need, I need to invest a, in a little trash can right here by my desk. Yeah, right? there you go. I end oh, up yeah. like cleaning up all these empty packs after last week's yeah. episode on the ground. <laughs> Every right, week so, it's like, I just like, Yeah. <laughs> We're going to uh, start things off. Rookie of Eddie Alvarez. We got another big rookie uh, in this set, Casey Mize from the Detroit Tigers. Right. Another big rookie, Sixto Sanchez. Mm-hmm. Uh, we got uh, Luis Castillo. We have a rookie cup second year, Kyle Lewis, AL rookie of the year last year. Steven Vogt. We got Trey Turner. Uh, Jorge Alfaro. Uh, this one is, what year is this? I don't know what year this is, but it's an insert. Uh, Cody Bellinger. What? 84? Oh, or 88, maybe? Yeah. I think you might be right. 89. Okay. 89. 89. 89. Okay. Oh, 89. 89. Okay. 89. Okay. I was like, like that looks like the 80s. Yeah. I just remember the year. Right on. 80s. It's a nice card. Paul Goldschmidt. Nice. Atlanta Braves team card. Minnesota Twins team card. Colorado Rockies team card. <laughs> <laughs> and Brett Gardner. So you got all those rookies at the beginning. You got yeah. all those rookies. And that's a nice Cody Dollinger card there. Yeah. I that's think the team player. cards are high cards, maybe, yeah. if I remember correctly. Yeah. All right. Here we go. Uh, let's start out with uh, Brian Goodwin, former Angel, right? Yep. Yep. I didn't even know he's on the Reds. It's a shame uh, they New Dodger. Really solid. New Dodger, uh, Trevor Bauer. League leaders, uh, Amir Garrett, former Yankee. My gosh, all Reds. <laughs> Keep yeah. those Reds coming. DJ LeMahieu, former Rocky. Yep. Let's see if I can go all former. Uh, Roberto Perez, uh, former uh, a former and current Indian. <laughs> hey, look on the back of the card. I'll tell you. Jeez. Well, that's what I say. It's 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 uh, he only has Indians. All right. So all right. Uh, Brandon Drury, uh, Mauricio Dubon. Uh, Cattell Marte, former Mariner. I know that. There you go. <laughs> uh, Glaber Torres on the uh, foil. Oh, nice. Uh, yeah, cool card. Uh, Francisco Lindor. Uh, now a Matt. Right? Am I right on that? Yes. He's a, yep. Okay. Everybody's been moving. Uh, Teoscar uh, Hernandez. <laughs> I, I like the face covering. Very good. And uh, yeah. Yeah. Uh, one of my favorite players who's oh, retiring yeah. this year, Albert Pujols. I didn't get a chance to see that. There's a video of him opening up packs that you shared today, right? I didn't get a chance yeah, to see it. On our Twitter, yeah, he was opening up packs right before. I didn't have a chance to look at it either, but I, that's why I uh, uh, started I think it's it up there. from the 90s. Uh, this guy, which uh, I like him. Uh, I dislike him for many reasons. Um, uh, and then um, I, I probably like this guy for um, less reasons than uh, Roberto Osuna. <laughs> okay. 
So, uh, Kevin. Let's get let's get some anger out there, all right? You know, <laughs> yeah. you can tell us how you feel, Michael. Don't worry, it's just me, you, and Angelo. Don't worry. Yeah. No, yeah, yeah. Osuna is not a good guy. All right, I'm going to be starting off off here with rookie card of Albert Abreu. Uh, rookie card of wow, uh, Tariq Scooball. Wow, I'm glad he's a pitcher because I hope we can throw a screwball to go if his name Scooball. <laughs> uh, Charlie. It's funny. You don't think this is a Nolan Arenado card, but it's Charlie Blackman. Yeah. <laughs> uh, we got uh, Jake Bowers. Byron Buxton. Buster Posey. Let's see. Rookie card here of uh, on the Blue Jays, Nate Pearson. We got Mr. Vlad Jr. Jesus Aguilar. Oh my goodness! Get your beers ready and look at this. Look at this. This is a cool insert here. Ooh, my, that's a cool card. Smile of Christian Yellick, and I love it because I was born seventy five. So seventy five. It's Wonderful. a seventy five style card. Ooh, that's really nice, and it's Yelly. Wow, that's yeah. awesome. Yeah, cheers to that. Sorry. All right. So Angelo, um, that wasn't done, card? sir. That wasn't my last card. I was just taking a drink. Sorry, I'll be quick. Now I gotta hurry. Um, yeah, Juan Soto. Uh-oh. Uh, yeah, Juan Soto. Um, I'll just show you the others. Jose Arena. Um, this is a cool-looking card, though. Josh Harrison. That yeah. third. And Detroit Tigers team card. But you know my high card. So we're done. Okay. So, well, let's... <laughs> let's 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 do the formalities. What do you got? Three twenty six. Oh no! <laughs> yeah, wow, that's a three oh nine. Oh, it's a. Uh, but um, let's let's see kill that card, card. Kevin. Kill so card. kill card is what three twenty? Three thirty. Three thirty. Three thirty. Yeah, three thirty. Three thirty. Wow. There it is. Okay, so Kevin. Uh, wow. Come on, An I think Angel got that last week. So come on, Michael. You need yeah. to get one of those. Yeah, so seven points. Nicely done. All right. All right. So, uh, you are up. All right. Let me get a pack here. Let's see what we got. See, Angelo, you, you got in trouble there calling your – you said, let's get that dub. Don't call your shot. You got to be careful there. Uh, how much <laughs> is this down worth? We're at the third inning here. We're in the third inning. This one is worth six. All right. Sounds good here. Let's see what we got. All right, starting off with the rookie card of Nick Heath. Actually, here's your section, uh, Michael. Uh, Tristan McKenzie. Okay, nice. Oh, but then this is cool. All right, I'll take this guy right here. Picture of Otani. Nice. Otani Shue. Nice, I like that one. Let's see here. We got a uh, league leader of Shane Bieber. All right, I'm going to take another drink. Here comes Orlando Arcia. Nice. Excuse me for a second. I like our brewer right here. We're getting some good brewers here. We have um, rookie card of Evan White on the Mariners. We got Jesse Winker. There's a lot of rookies in this set. Another rookie card here. This is a uh, Luis Garcia. Uh, Carter Kaboom, not quite a rookie, but definitely an up and coming prospect for them. Here we got uh, Sean Doolittle, which is funny because I have like looking at the catch. I'm like, no, it's Doolittle. It was on that card. All right. And we have here the uh, Tampa Bay Rays. I'm guessing – Yeah, I don't know if it's a team card or not because there's no checklist, but there you go. Do a little help. The old Bass Brothers gimmick there. Yeah, you know? exactly. <laughs> well, you have to in COVID, you know? Yeah. Oh, my goodness. Get it ready again. Look at this right here. There you go. Your team card. Uh, this says dab on – oh, they're dabbing. There you go. They're dabbing. So that is the checklist card. Sorry, here I got two more here. Uh, league leader of Juan Soto. So I know that's the one you got earlier, Michael. Mm -hmm. And lastly, uh, another rookie guard of Brady Singer. Nice. All right. All right, Angelo, you're up. And and as always, we appreciate the um, the useless trivia. Uh, Orlando Arcia went to the dentist today. Yes. yes. Very good to know. <laughs> I need to go to the dentist. I, I Yeah. I need money to go to the dentist. It's going to be a lot of work that's going to be done when I do that. All right. John Means. Lucas Giolito. Freddie Galvez. 
Jacoby Jones. We have future stars Justin Dunn, Matt Chapman, Joaquim uh, Sorbi Soria. Mm -hmm. We have uh, Randy Dobnak, Lewis Brinson. We got an 86 Anthony Rendon. So oh, nice. Going in the personal collection. Actually, just picked up a Joe Adele 86 on eBay earlier this week. Nice. Uh, Leody Traveras, Mike Miner. We have a World Series Walker Bueller and Mamamamuki. <laughs> nice. All right. So here we go. My packs. Yeah, has anybody in the chat, have you guys uh, had any of these? Um, do you guys get anything? Did you get anything good in it? Um, what's the best thing you got out of here? Uh, Alex Aplutko. Uh, Gio Gonzalez. Wilson Contreras. Mitch Moreland. Uh, you guys might recognize this dude. Yeah, I, I got him one of my cards. Hopefully it, he's all right. Mike Fish. Uh, Steven Vogt. Uh, Trey Turner. Uh, Jorge Alfaro. Uh, Brandon Kin Kinsler. Is it? I think Kinsler? So. I think it's Kinsler. It's nit, nit, like Nitzler. Nitzler or Kinsler? Kin Kinsler. Uh, Eugenio Suarez on the uh, 2022 Home Run Derby. Oh, right on. The uh, Derby Challenge. So I cool. have to remember about that. Yeah. Uh, uh, Texas Rangers card. Uh, Joey Mendel. Is it? Oh, Joey Wendell. Joey Wendell, yep. Uh, get Up. Uh, Met Star Celebrate. Yep. I already wrapped and that one earlier. Humberto Mejia. All right. So, uh, Kevin, you were first, right? Yes, I was first. Uh, I believe this is one of your high cards earlier. Mr. Tristan McKenzie, 319, 319. Ooh, that's going to be tough to beat. Well, it, so far today, we've had a lot of high cards. Yeah, that's that's good. Mike Miner, 329. Oh, right. I remember getting that one last week. I was like, yeah. I got nothing. I got nothing. So Angelo takes the uh, six points. Six points. Wow. So that Angelo. is the third inning. Uh, inning four worth four points. Angelo's won two out of three so far. He has. He's working his way out of the cellar. Good job. All right. Next pack. <sighs> Uh, David Peterson, uh, rookie Anderson Tejada. That uh, David Peterson was a rookie, also. We got a uh, rookie Kiebert Ruiz, uh, Ryan Mountcastle, D. Strange Gordon. Uh, we got Glaber, Josh Donaldson. Uh, get your beers ready for Avisel oh, Gar yeah. Garcia. Oh, nice. yeah. Drink it up. Can we find out? Did he go to the orthopedist today? <laughs> he had someone yeah. go for him. Oh, okay, very good. Michael Franco. Jack Flaherty. Oh. Chris Archer. New York Yankees team card. Uh, we got Andrew Benetiendi. Don't send it to whoever that was, Michael, because then he... Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> right? Yep. Uh, I, John, I, John Gray. I sent Balcony uh, Sports Chatter um, a little care package, and it was a head of Andrew Benetiendi, a oh, little relic. Right. Yep. <laughs> and then he went to the Royals like a couple days later. Yep. 
uh let's uh kevin why why don't you go oh by the way let me uh what well, before while you're opening that up yes sir um Ke uh, angelo I i'm doing this strictly to jinx you um you are in second place now oh. in our standings angelo you, you just jinxed me mike <laughs> well, he did, I, you know he called I, a I shot that, earlier and he jinxed himself i he did that expressively to jinx you because i'm owing 14 today yeah exactly <laughs> you know, good send, send, some, send, send some mojo it wouldn't be baseball if we weren't superstitious. Come on. Yeah. yeah. Colin Duncan, uh, Jay Flair. Yeah. Uh, there you uh, go. He's going to be a good one. All right. We got uh, Eloy Jimenez. Chris Davis. Your National League MVP, Freddie Freeman. Uh, Rafael Devers. Uh, Jake Odorosi. Bryce Harper, Kirby Yates, Archie Bradley. I want to look at this one because it's that it actually was like this. It was backwards, it's, but it's the a Christian Tache. It's that's a short print on the, no, on the, short on print. the yeah. If you look at the back on the the number on the very bottom next to tops dot com, it's going to end in four digits. What's the four digits it's ending in? Three two three zero, yeah. So that's the super. That's the super short print, I think. Right on. So that's definitely that's a short, we're done. Yeah, well, that's, that's a nice that's one. That's definitely a short print. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, that's well, a good, that and, Kristen, I, remember, I remember your video mentioning that. Kristen uh, Pache is a, is a uh, great a Braves. Uh, I actually saw him oh, in yeah. Arizona Fall League like like two or three years ago. Yeah, he's a good think, one. Oh, so it's the year after I I went with you. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. All right. Well, that one. That that's a good one. That's a good one to have. That's a winner there. All right, we have uh, Ian Anderson. Uh, David Dahl. We should call him Aqualung. Hey. Uh, <laughs> Oliver Perez. Still in the league. And, and Wade LeBlanc. Speaking of people still in the league, I'm like, that guy's still yeah. around. And uh, Slam Diego. For, you know, for the slams of the games. And that's the uh, checklist card. Nice. Okay. Um, yeah, Cowboy Jack Durango crushing the Pedialyte. That's right. He's, uh, up for some surgery, right? Or he's doing some, or, or solidarity with his da daughter, right? Is that what I saw yep. earlier? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I was like, what are you, you're talking about him? Okay. He's crushing Pedialyte. I thought you meant. Yeah. <laughs> and I don't I know, know maybe. Old players. <laughs> for me, I just thought about more... me. I'm like, yeah, I'll spike my beer with Pedialyte. That's more our uh, jam, like uh, exactly. a Geritol, right? Oh, a Geritol my smoothie. Geritol. I'm grabbing the Geritol <laughs> my beer today. Oh, man. Yeah. Uh, Brandon Belak. Boy, I have not. Why have I not heard any of these players? He's a rookie card. That's why. You got to hashtag do the research. Wait, wait a second. Well, he played He played 12 games. I mean, he was 3-3. Three and three. Well, then again, I wasn't watching the Astros last year. Um, Who was? I mean, to be fair. True. Although you know what we 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 said at the end of last year, I go they're going to go to the World Series. Watch them. They actually had a little run at the end. Remember? It, I mean that was amazing. Those uh, the CL series, the NLCS and the LCS series, because we almost had two three nothing comebacks, which yeah. I've been insane. We have both yeah. go to Game Seven, and the only time that ever happened was that 2004 Red Sox series. Yeah, you just outed yourself. You said you didn't watch Major League Baseball last year. I. Didn't say I watched it, but I might you know. I know what happened. <laughs> so senior research analyst. All right. Jeez. <laughs> Michael Lorenzo. How dare uh, you, Tim sir. Anderson. Sorry, <laughs> I don't want to disper disparage you. Uh, Jose Quintana. Uh, Josh <laughs> Donaldson. Get your bears ready, Avisel Garcia. Hey. Didn't you get it? Oh, someone got him earlier. I did. Yeah. Uh, Michael Franco, Tony Gonzalez. Well, I love that little the little cup right there. That's oh, yeah. always yeah, that, that's that's been around since at least the eighties. Yeah, yeah. I'm a, it's a rookie all star cool. team or something, right? Yeah, it's, uh, he's basically the top rookie pitcher in the right in the NL or whatever. Yep. Uh, Luis uh, Patino, is that right? Is it Patino? Okay. Uh, this is a cool card. I'm glad I got this one. Uh, Ooh, Yadier Molina. Nice. That's a cool one. I like that a lot. Good stuff. PC, uh, baby. Uh, Wilson Ramos. 
Clayton Kershaw from the uh, World Series. That's a World Series card. So World 2020 World Series highlights. Uh, I you know what? Uh, living in LLA, you know, I, it's like you know the Dodgers. I mean the the Dodger Stadium is the closest stadium to me. Uh, I'm actually happy for this guy because this guy's had the toughest playoff run. Uh, the Cardinals, uh, you know, crush him. Uh, other teams, but he's had a really hard luck. I was really happy to see him actually get finally get his due because he's a very good player. Uh, Lourdes uh, Guriel. And oh, this is a cool one. Uh oh. So this is the Luis uh, Robert. This might right. be, this seems like a short print as well. Um, was it backwards in the past? It wasn't backwards, but I mean, okay. maybe I haven't seen this one, but it, I mean, this is a cool one. None of us have gotten Luis Robert yet, I don't think. I don't think so either. So that's, that's maybe that's that, why I thought that. 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 that was at Wrigley too, you know. Uh, Angelo, have you gotten? All right. So I got, yeah, I went already. So I had 307. 307. Kevin? Oh, you both just got that in the same back. Uh, my Slam Diego is 323. Oh, oh I know. 323. Over the oh. heel heat here. Over the heel heat. Darn it. No. So I think, um, I mean, 307 was mine. Oh. No. So, right. Kevin? Yeah. <laughs> Kevin, four points. All right. I'll take it. Michael Mondragon, come on. I, I, so it's been Angelo, Kevin, Angelo, Kevin. Uh, this is inning five, only worth two points, but it is a yeah. wild card round. Um, so, Michael? I yep. want to know, look at the hat on your head and remember 1988, all right? <laughs> uh, yeah, 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 totally. Oh, my gosh. I didn't think about that. Uh, the I, I mean, how would you? I mean, that's what I'm here for. Yeah, but you know what? I like to consider myself the 70s version of the Orioles or the 83 <laughs> version of the Orioles. I was going to say, don't say, well, I mean, maybe early 70s. I was thinking like, yeah, early they were 70s. good by the mid to late 70s. No, that's when they won their championships. Uh, oh, the 60s, too. I, I wasn't involved in the 60s, so. I know you want to be Brooke, you want to be Brooks or Frank. I got gotcha. you or yeah. Jim Palmer and his, in his jockeys, Eddie Murray, Jim Palmer, no, you want Jim Palmer and his jockeys. All right. <laughs> Boog, That's what you Boog really Powell. Want. <laughs> Powell. Oh, there you, you go. <laughs> all right. We're going to start off here with a uh, future stars card of Justin Dunn. Uh, rookie card here of Monte Harrison. Another rookie card here, of Joey Bart. Another rookie card here, uh, Dylan Carlson. There you go. Another rookie card here. We got, um, it's weird. This one was upside down. So I'm going to take a look at it here and wonder why that is. But uh, it's uh, Brandon Belak. We have Lewis uh, Brinson, Witt Merrifield, Austin Riley, Michael Taylor. M -m -m Mookie Betts, <laughs> Paul DeJong, Caleb Smith, Luke Weaver, and Kevin Kymeyer. So I'll just take a look at that card earlier that was upside down because that was there was nothing else really noteworthy in that pack. So all right, let's see what we got. So we got a Michael Lorenzen, Tim Anderson, Jose Quintana, Brian Goodwin, Kyle Seeger, Max Stacy, Stasi, yep. Cody Bellinger, JD Davis, Roman Quinn. We got another insert here. This is a 2004 Tops. Oh, cool card. Don Mattingly. What year is that? Oh, 2004. 2004. Four. That's weird. Don't even That's recognize the design that. when he was even with. Okay. I didn't know. They, I'd never seen those cards. Right Wilson on. Ramos. We got the Clayton Kershaw World Series highlights. And uh, we got Lourdes Guriel Jr. And the Lou Bob that Mike just got. Oh, there you go. Nice. Nice. Uh, I'm going to steal the spotlight and go next because I feel like 
as someone who's 0 and 18, I better get in all the shots I can. <laughs> you, yeah. Uh, Come on, fi find Mr. Soto. Yeah, Not the link real. leader Soto. You need to get the actual Soto here. Come on. Brandon Workman. Bobby Dalbeck. Uh, it's not junior, but it is Bobby Delbeck. Uh, Danny Duffy. Uh, Joe Adele. There you go. Nice. Oh, nice. There you go. Very good. Closer. Uh, Michael Taylor. Gio Urshela. Francisco Mejia. Kyle Seeger. Corey's brother. Uh... Max Stassi, who we did, you just had that one, right? Yep. Oh, look at this. Look at this. Fernando Tatis Jr. Ooh, nice. On the 79. 79, yeah. Okay. I was trying to remember what style that was. Very cool. Yeah. The 14 uh, year man. I'm jealous. Uh, it's funny. It's funny. Like everybody, er when A Rod got his uh, quarter of a billion dollars, um, everybody was all pissed off. But he got his. Everybody's like, oh, cool. <laughs> well, it's different times. You know, he was the first guy. Yeah, yeah he's he's that's very that's well liked. You know, people were flipping out in the eighties when Kirby Puckett got like a three million dollar per year deal back in the eighties. I remember going to a spring training game. I want to say it was in the eighties. Um, maybe it was even like early nineties. And Brett Butler was was uh, being <laughs> booed by the Indians fans because he made a million dollars. Oh my god! <laughs> How dare you? You're How you're breaking the you? bank. How dare uh, you? Yeah, Pirates. Uh, this is uh, Ryan Brazier. Wow, this is. Uh, can you imagine this being your card? It's so. It's. it's wow. I was like, All right. <laughs> Very. I'm not your Boston fan there, there, right? No. This is the guy that we stole from the Rockies. Uh, the Cardinals did. I didn't steal him. Um, oh, my friend Nolan. Yeah. Your friend Nolan. And uh, he'll be. Actually, throw into this guy. Oh, yeah, there uh, you go. Paul Goldschmidt, another nice. guy we stole from the Diamondbacks. Yeah. <laughs> All right, Angela, you're up. Highway robbery. Uh, I went, I just went. Actually. Oh, sorry, sorry. Yeah, he's he's getting you off his high card. Yeah, so yeah, my high card is 223. Two, 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 oh, no, that's it. Oh, jeez. Yep, that's it. Well, Mr. Whit Merrifield is 327. That's going to be a tough one to beat. <sighs> yeah, I know. Are you kidding? Kevin won again. Oh, jeez. Wow. wow. Two in a row, but he only won. Hey, you know what? Points. You guys got your fancy inserts. I didn't get anything in that pack That's except scary. a win. So there we go. Oh, get the my God. Rights. I can't. I'm 0 and 20. <laughs> well, who, it's who even is... worse than the 88 Orioles. I think they start off like 0 and 17 or something like that. That's right. You're, you're absolutely right, actually. Hey, you have been happy to get two points after all that. All right, now we're on our next wild card, which is worth uh, six. Is that correct? Six, absolutely. All right, I'm sorry. I'm trying to organize my cards as I'm doing this. I'm like, I should probably do this after the show. Although by then I'll have a lot of beers, so we'll see how that goes. All right, let's see what we got here. Okay. Wow. Oh. Starting off here with Mike Fulte. I'm not going to try the rest of it. Fulton Nevich. Fulton Nevich, thank you. There you go. Uh, Ian Happ, Joey Votto, Jordan Alvarez, Evan Longoria, Miles Nicolas, JD Martinez, Ahmed Rosario, Hector Neris. Hey, speaking of your team that you're wearing on your head, check out my 80s. Oh, there you go. Robinson. There you go. There's a 70s. A good sign. Right here. Let's go. The human Hoover. Yeah. Man, hell of a, amazing ball player right there. Yep. Uh, business pack off, we have Alex Verdugo, Patrick Sandoval, uh, Miguel Rojas, and to close it out, get your beers ready. Here's yeah. Your beers. That's a double. Uh, yeah, just as Milwaukee Brewers. I was looking for something fancy, but nope. Good. Cheers. All right, Angelo. All right. Um, yeah, go for it. Mm. 
All right, we got league leaders, Trevor Bauer. We got Amir Garrett. League leaders, DJ LeMahieu. We got Roberto Perez. We have rookie Chris Bubik. Tommy Edmond. Joey Gallo. Liam Hendricks. Colin Moran, Francisco Lindor, Teoscar, uh, Teoscar Hernandez, Albert Pujols, that guy that Michael doesn't like. <laughs> Is Justin Verlander yeah. next? <laughs> and there, you the yep. oh, there you go. There you go. Same Colin order. Says, last. There you go. Kevin is the Eddie Guerrero. Hey, hey whoa, whoa, whoa. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. <laughs> wait a minute. There's nothing up these sleeves. Nothing up these sleeves. All right. Nothing. Nothing except yeah, there's 330. Cool. Do what? Yeah. <laughs> there's, there's so much going on in the chat. I can't even keep up with all the talk. Yeah. I, I, I got to really remember to turn it on as we do this. Boo all right. Bird. Come on, Michael. All right. Here we go. What do you got for us? Uh, by show. the way, I'm I'm actually going to summon uh, the spirit of the white rat. There you white go, Herzog. Let's do it. Let's get this going. Let's let's get off the slide. You have to do. Has that card been sitting on Duck, uh, Mr. Funkin' Wagon's porch since noon today? <laughs> yes, it I is. saw you yelled up to your head like that. <laughs> uh, yeah. Uh -huh. uh, this is a cool card. Uh, oh, doing it for the high. fans. Uh, Doing it for the cutouts. Very interesting card. Very <laughs> that's a new one. I've never seen that yeah, one. Yeah, I good. don't. This is this is very odd. Uh, yeah. So that's the team card. Uh, Nico Goodrum from the Tigers. Uh, Marcel Ozuna. Uh, check out his Instagram. <laughs> <laughs> Top Gun Chalwar, a favorite here at the Bear Baseball Vlog. Uh, yep. He's a big Braves fan, so we follow uh, Big Bear Ozuna. On Instagram, he, uh, I don't know, he might be divorced from his wife now, but uh, he has a very cool. interesting wife. Um, yep, that, and, yeah, uh, like, that interesting is a good word. Now, this is an awesome one. So, everybody would say Anthony Santander is actually, when I went to go see the Orioles, uh, I have a video of it, it's Anthony Santander. Oh, that's how you pronounce that. Thank you. Yes, uh, <laughs> Cody Whitley. On the Cardinals, I do not remember him playing. I was like, why are you laughing about him? Why are you laughing at the guy? He played in four games in 2020. I have no idea who this is. <laughs> uh, I, I saw him in spring training. I'm like, who is that guy? Uh, but he's actually in spring training already. This guy I like a lot. Mike Yastrzemski, third oh, yeah. generation player, right? Yep. I mean, t I, I don't know how you would describe it because it, it wasn't like he had a dad who played. Obviously, so he skipped. Grandfather. Yeah. So his grandfather is... Uh, of course, good old Carl. Yeah, oh. Carl. Yeah, with the with the long sideburns. That's a oh, Simpsons yeah. reference. Thank you. Yep. Jesus, uh, is this? Oh, Jesus Sanchez. Uh, Patrick Corbin. Starling Marte. On the Ooh, Marlins, uh, former nice. Pirate. Oh, nice. Yeah, that was eighty-six. I thought it was like the Giants, the way the the font looked. I'm like, oh wait, no, because uh, the the that with the Marlins and the. In the orange, that looked kind of odd. Well, it, it's odd because the Marlins weren't around. Yeah, sick. So it, right. it definitely, they didn't even have this, so they had to make that right. Uh, Brendan McKay, uh, Tyler Chatwood, uh, Ronald Acuna Jr. That's a cool card. Uh, Yuri Gurriel. And Ian Kennedy, former Diamondback. There you go. Thank you. Going back to your former theme. <laughs> yeah, I, I can. I can do that for most every player. Um, all right. So, what? Uh, who went first? That'd be me, sir. All right. Uh, Jordan Alvarez, uh, three hundred. Oh, three hundred. All right. That's Angela. beatable. Come on, we've had some high cards. Totally. Today. Three fourteen. There you go. Tommy Edmund, three fourteen. Come on, Michael. <sighs> Let them play. <laughs> Thank you, White Rat. Anthony Santendier, 320. All right. Back I'm in the game. I'm to get you on the board. Very good. 
from uh, Venezuela. I wasn't from Margarita, Venezuela. Nicely done. He thanked yeah, white, you it's a white rat and an Oreo hat juju right there. Yep. Double juju. Yeah, well, see, uh, uh, and Oreo got me uh, some, some points. So love it. Love it. All right. So. All right. Now we're at the seventh inning. Seventh inning. Oh, touch. wait, 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 wait. What? Oh. We didn't do this last time. I know. I. I uh... <laughs> what? That was a good one. Ah, oh, seventh inning. But I don't buy me some more beers. <laughs> yeah, beer sales are cut off in, uh, after this inning, right? Oh no! I better. Hurt. Oh no! Oh no! What am I gonna we'll, do? We'll, we'll be like Iowa. We'll go into the eighth inning, bottom oh, of the eighth. That that's definitely the beer baseball uh, blog rule. Go into the eighth. All right. Yeah, I, I think County. I I got. I had that too. It was eighth inning. I'm like, woo! <laughs> so excited. <laughs> I always get this guy on my fantasy baseball teams because he gets a lot of saves. Brad Hand. Brad, good hand. That's right. Nomar <laughs> Mazzara, former uh, Ranger. Austin Hayes. Uh, let's see. Robbie Ray, uh, former Diamondback. Yeah. Hang on right now. Uh, Reese Hoskins, always been a, a Philly. Yep. Aaron Judge, always Judge. been a Yankee. Uh, Marwin uh, Gonzalez, uh, actually uh, uh, Astros. Yes, yeah, right. Yeah. Get your beers ready, oh, Brandon good Woodruff. Good time, me refilling there. Yeah, boy, I, mean, I I love I love their uniforms. They're so cool. Uh, this one is actually a, oh. a numbered card, uh, oh, Danny nice. Mendick. I think it, it's uh, is it a red? Yeah, red nice. out of uh, twenty five actually. Ooh, oh wow! Danny Mendick. Wow. Yeah, cool card. Very good. Congratulations on that one. That's uh, our first Dod numbered card I think that we've gotten. Period so far. Yeah, Dodgers. Uh, Kike Hernandez now now a Cub, right? No, no. you're thinking of Jock Peterson. Jock Peterson. Jock, Jock a Peterson's a Cub. Where where yeah. did where did Kike go? I don't know. Yeah, nice. Mets. I don't know if he left. Was that, was that it? I don't know if he left yet. No, he did. He did. He, he did. did. Okay. I just still think about Jock Pearson. It was almost an angel. <laughs> that deal didn't happen. You guys are. You guys recognize this guy, Garrett Richards. Yeah. Oh man. I'm glad to see Kike him back now. Red Sox. Kike went to the Red Sox. Okay. Red Sox. That's right. Um, <laughs> former Angel Jock Peterson. <laughs> <laughs> not quite. That was not official, sir. That was not official, sir. Hey, now you can say former Dodger. That's hey, that's true. Former Dodger, true. Dodger, John Peterson. And I and I actually, you know what? This is weird. Uh -oh. It's the same card, although it has two numbers. Jacob Degrom. It's the same. It's the, almost the same picture. Yeah, one's it, it's a, a little one's different. His arm is one's a league leaders. One's a regular. His regular card. So. But if you look, it is a different pose. It's very. It's slightly different. It's slight, slight. It's slight. Yeah. All right. Uh, I'll go with uh, Kevin. All righty. Let's see what we got here. Still some dangerous stuff potentially in this box, hopefully. Let's see what we got here. In your box. All right. Starting off with your uh, league leader, uh, Luke Voigt. Oh, uh, Josh Reddick. Future stars of Blue Star Gradual. Uh, rookie guard here from the Mets. We have Andres Jimenez. Mark uh, Canna. We have Willie Calhoun. Salvador Perez. This is a cool shot here of uh, Albert Albor Jr. I like nice. him. A nice shot idea. there. We have uh, Julio Urias. I laughed off the dig through this, but I got this card in the others in the in my box topper pack, I believe. Josh Donaldson with the Twins. Nice. Uh, yeah, hang on. I'll show you really fast. I want to see if it's the exact same card. Is it the exact same card? Let's see. Oh, I just dropped the card. Okay, let's see. So there you go. Oh, it actually is different. Wow. I was, that's what I was curious about. Right on. Cool. Sorry about that. I just figured that was worth the look to see if those are different because th obviously that one is pretty rare. It's one of those packs per box. All right, moving on here. We have uh, Ricky Hardier of Humberto and Meja. 
Uh, another rookie card here of Nick uh, Nadert. Oh, I never heard of this guy. Obviously, I haven't heard of him. He's a Marlin rookie. Uh, we have here uh, Nick Senzel. And closing out, the biggest surprise of the Angels last year, Mr. Dylan Bundy. Yeah. Former Oriole. Yes. Go for it, Angelo. Now they got former Oriole Alex Cobb in the offseason. So there you go. There you go. So that worked out. Fun fact about uh, the Miami Marlins in 2019, uh, the Las Vegas Aviators. Um, had better attendance record than the Miami Marlins did. <laughs> oh, <geez. laughs> they also had uh, a better. They also had a better attendance record than uh, the Tampa Bay Rays in 2019. Yep. they were preparing I'm, yeah, for COVID. I'm not surprised. That's, that's a really nice stadium, and when I went, it drew a really big crowd for minor yep. league, especially. Carlos Correa, Daniel Murphy, Brad Goodhand. Uh, we got Nomar Mazzara. I think this is your pack, Mike. Tony Gonsolin. Oh, yeah. That's one from before, right? Luis Patino. Yeah. <laughs> Brandon Drury. Mm -hmm. Mauricio yeah, Devon. Mm -hmm. Cattell Marte. Yeah. <laughs> you did not get this one. This is an 86 Ryan Sandberg. Oh, wow. Very nice. Nice one there. That's a cool one. We got uh, Chadwick Trump. Uh, we got a elbows only air high five, Los Angeles Angels. Go. We got Kevin Gausman. Mm -hmm. And uh, this guy's all right, Max Scherzer. Yeah, he's, he's, he's all right in his of himself. Yeah. Right. Who, uh, Kevin, you went first, right? Or, oh, you I did. went first. Yeah. 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 You actually won. Come on. Yeah. I'm not used to that. Um, also, <laughs> this is, this is worth, this is also worth, uh, nine points. So I'm going to come in with a very piddly 279 on that. Oh, that's your numbered card, though. The number card. Well, I was going to say, good luck because this is a tough one to beat. 324. <sighs> oh. Well, Kevin, I would have beat that with 325. Yeah, but that wasn't my winning card. Oh my I actually God. got three twenty eight. Also, wow, wow. Kevin goes Ew, a lot there. In. Very good. Nine Very good. points. Good one. I'm like, uh, only like six cards can beat that, and you got two of them. I did. <laughs> Very All good. Right. Well, he's not with a time. Like, let me open my pack. Get going. All right. Uh, we're we at the eighth it. inning, right? How much is this worth? Eighth inning is worth eight points. Oh, yeah. Austin Hayes. Robbie Ray. Mm -hmm. Yeah, this is one of Michael's last packs. Do it for the fans. Do it for the cutouts. There you go. Nico Goodrum. <laughs> Marcelo Zuna. This shows me the game. You got to like, name who had the pack, and, name, and the person has to name the order. <laughs> Javier uh -huh. Baez. We got uh, Gene Segura, Colton Wong. That's a, that's a new brewer. Oh, <laughs> I, I, I need an excuse, but. We got a silver foil rookie of Humberto Mejia. Nice. Nice one there. Uh, we got the LA Dodgers team card slash Chicago Cubs right there and uh, Boston Red Sox. Yep. There you go. G Rich. Oh, man. Jacob deGrom and a former Angel and Dodger, Jock Peterson. <laughs> and, and league leaders, Jacob deGrom. That was like oh, nice. I see you got that. Yeah, yeah that's yeah. Michael. That's you. That's funny. Totally. All right, Kevin. You're... Oh, I'm up. All right. I'm doing, I'm like working, 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 working. All right. Sorry, guys. Let's get this baby going here. Eighth inning. Let's see who is our setup man. Who has our setup man back? Or for uh, people who are hoping to come back, the opener. So who's going to yes. be the opener? Yep. Let's see. We have a league leader here, Marcel Ozuna. Uh, Sonny Gray. Buck Farmer. I do really like that name, Buck Farmer. Farmer. Who yeah. names their kid Buck these days? That's great. <laughs> uh, future stars here, Aristides Aquino. Polar Bear, Pete Alonzo. 
Ronald Guzman, Yadier Molina, Reese Hopkins. Uh, my 86 style card is Jose Altuve. I'm like, yeah, all right. <laughs> that guy. Yeah. Uh, we have uh, Trevor Williams. Hunter Renfro. Still weird seeing him on a on a uh, raised card. I had to like do a double take. I'm like, oh yeah. Uh, Griffin. Can uh, I can't talk. Griffin Canning. And we have uh, the Miami Marlins team card there. And uh, Jake Starietta to close it out there. Nice. Buck Farmer uh, reminds me uh, he should be on Hee Haw. Actually, it would yeah. be better than Buck Owens. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> Buck Farmer. Wow. Michael and I are really aging ourselves today for our references. Good job. Hey. Hey. Junior Samples, uh, Grandpa, Mini Pearl. Hey. Well, I was going to say, uh, Angel, do you even know what this TV show Hee Haw yeah, is? Yeah, have you heard of uh, Hee Haw? I have heard of the show Hee Haw. Okay. Yeah. Have you seen it? I'm not seeing it. <laughs> I barely ever saw it. I was like, you know, as a kid, I didn't want to watch that in the 80s. How dare you? It was actually, if you're uh, into 70s, it was not, not Benny Hill-esque, but they had some uh, nice eye candy as a uh, very young kid to watch that show. Nice. Uh, Kiebert Ruiz. That was that was Daisy Dukes before there was Daisy Dukes on, ah, on Dukes of Hazzard. Very good. Ryan Mountcastle. Uh, Carlos Correa. Link Buck Farmer is one of my new favorite players of that name. Yes, that, uh, the recent is it? Uh, yeah, d the recently retired uh, Daniel Murphy. Yep. Uh, Kirby Yates. Uh, Archie Bradley. I didn't even know he's on the Reds. Fear the beard. I know. I was just thinking the same thing, and he just signed with someone else. Um, because he was he was pretty big deal on the Di on the Diamondbacks. For the Diamondbacks, yeah, he was uh he was really good for them. Uh, yeah. Pete Alonso. There you go. I just got that card. Wait, oh, Ronald, no, Ronald Ronald Guzman. Yep. Oh no, who's next? Uh, another Yachty. Okay, so yeah, so I'm getting yep, the other ones. Yeah. Oh, this is cool. Uh, oh. Oh, 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 oh. Okay, so this is uh, from the 61 set. This is uh, Anthony Rizzo. Ooh, oh, wow. Nice. Very cool. So there you go. So nice. going through the 70 years of tops right there, Anthony Rizzo. Yep. Uh, I have never heard of this guy. <laughs> I can't believe I haven't or not heard of this. Um, not Chadwick Boseman, but Chad Chadwick Trump. T-R-O-M-P. Yeah, didn't you just get that card, Angelo? I just got that card, yeah. yeah. Wait, have you heard of him before this? No, no. Yeah. I'm trying crazy. to figure out what was going on with well, his, 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 re his reaction is why you've never heard of him. Yeah. Because that's the reaction. Like, that's the fly-out so, reaction. It almost looks <laughs> right? like a, an orange neck brace. It doesn't, I'm yeah. like, is that a sweater? Is that a neck brace? What is Gator. that? It's a gator. <laughs> that's wild. Or, or he it looks like, whoa. Or he's looking at the eclipse. Oh, um, geez. that's one of those. <laughs> that's one of those flyouts where I went to the warning track. Oh. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, totally, yep. totally. Or or pop out to first base. Uh, elbows only. Um, Kevin Gossman. It and Max Scherzer. See, that was the oh. end of one of Angelo's packs. <laughs> there you go. Oh God, okay. Card. Who went first? Uh, I did. And Javi Baez at 322, but Mike's uh, Kevin Cosman is going to oh, yeah. beat that. Yeah, I'm not going to beat that because I have a uh, – Jake Starietta is 317. There you go. I are you saying that I, that I got I got it with 328? You got it with 328? Well, I, I hope so. Oh, my goodness. So. All right, all right. Mm. I'll take that. Oh, oh wow. I think it was eight points. Hey. Eight points. Hey, 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 all right. So, all right. This is it. Nice this ending. Is, this is it. Make no mistake who you are. Who is that, Kevin? That would be Mr. Kenneth Loggins and uh, <laughs> Michael McDonald. <laughs> are you familiar with that song? Angela? Yes, I am, sir. No, not you. I know you. Oh, Angelo, well, this is huh? it. No? I love Michael McDonald, man. All right. You got to hey, check out that Kenny Loggins song. Doobie or Brothers. Look up, I, like, I, up the I, Yacht Rock. I, I grew up listening to Doobie Brothers and Earth, Wind, and Fire because my nice. mom 
Yeah, you'll right. love yacht rock. That's what Kevin and I are into. It's basically um, now it's like a lifestyle that Kevin right. and I. Yeah, it was like a it was like a YouTube parody show that whole era. And the first episode is talking about the making of this is it. Oh no, I think it's the second episode that they give this is it. It's ridiculous. Yeah. yeah. Uh, Chris Bubik, Royals. Uh, Bo, oh, this is an awesome name. Bo Burrows, the very wrestling name. Oh yeah, like, uh, Bo Beverly. We were just talking about the Beverlys. You were. Uh, I was just thinking about I, the Beverly Brothers. We were talking. Uh, I was listening to uh, a Hopkins and Riders podcast, and they brought up the Beverly Brothers. So I was like, "Oh, nicely I was done." Like, oh man, I wonder whatever happened to Wayne Bloom and you know Mike I mean? Enos. So, yeah, you know, yeah. So, so there's there's uh, double uh, Bo Burrows and Bo Bichette. Nice. So I got I I got a to- now I got to get uh, Bo Jackson, and I'll, I'll have like a. a uh, but I got another royal, uh, Jacob. Oh, you'll, 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 if, you, if, you, if you pulled Bo Jackson, Jackson. You'd, ha- you'd have a Trebo. Yeah. <laughs> uh, <laughs> like Tim Tebow card. Is or a Tybo. Uh, this is Javier Baez, uh, Jean Segura, or Gene to you. Uh, I got wait, a Brewer, um, Colton Wong. <laughs> Man, what a, what an infield they would have had if they would have kept him, right? Right. Uh, Danny Santana. Okay, this is uh, the 73 edition. Oh, yeah. I'm getting all these ones of Jacob deGrom. Wow. Cool. That's a really cool one. That's cool. That I remember, like, t- oh, what, Tom Seaver? This was a very famous one. Uh, the Royal Crown Cola, I think, is in this mm-hmm. picture, if I'm not mistaken. I think uh, so. Uh, this is the walk-off instant celebration from the uh, Giants. Josh Bell. Uh, on the Nationals now, Sean Doolittle. I uh, forgot where he went to. He went to another team as well. Uh, Tampa Bay Rays. There you go. And get your beers ready if you Thank still you. have them. Uh, the dab on them. Because I was about to say, I'm like, we're really overdue for some brewers. I'm, I'm like, I know we're going to do a lot of cards today. We better get two beers ready. Yeah. So this one is worth five. Um, so who wants to go next? So I'm next. Kevin's in the lead, so we can build the anticipation. Oh, do you oh, want to go? You want to go next? Yeah, you go. Go, Angelo. Go, Angelo. All right. I'll take the bomb of the ninth. <laughs> I can be like Reggie Jackson was a kid and strike out or, or hit one out. <laughs> Red. All right, so we got uh, Ryan Castellini, Cassel- uh, rookie Nick Heath, Tristan McKenzie. <laughs> Yeah, you're the third person to get that series of cards in a row today. Shohei Otani. You might as well put that Tristan Ke- uh, McKenzie up, Tristan card off to the side. That's a high one. League, league leaders, Shane Bieber. We got uh, Jesse Winkler. Luis Garcia, rookie. Carter Keyboom. Evan Longoria. Miles Mikolas. We have a uh, the bronze, I think. Oh, is, oh, this oh. is Omar Navarez, number to 2021. Cool. Get your beers ready Brewer. for Brewer. Nice. All right. We got um, league leader Juan Soto, not kill card Juan Soto. Yep. Brady Singer and Alex Verdugo. Nice. All right, Kevin, while, while you're getting yours together, uh, I want to answer this question. Yeah, now that Wong is gone, uh, who do you think uh, is going to play second base? Uh, Matt Carpenter is probably going to play. Um, but they have to figure something out. I'm not even sure who is even in their uh, farm system uh, to play second base. So, yeah, I, I think Carpenter is. Um, but I have I really have no idea. That was, I, that was a bigger loss, and I remember that at the time. That that was um, they, there's just no way they could have kept him, uh, just the way the logistics. Did they have a, go. someone else they could shift over to that place. That, that that's Carpenter basically because he used Carpenter. to play third. Okay. Okay. You know they they shifted another uh, like Nolan Gorman is now is, is like playing left field because of <laughs> Arenado yeah. now. Right. So like, he cleared everybody out. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Well, that's kind of like Joe Adele. You know, he's probably been put in right field. It's like, all right, you got to play right field. <laughs> oh yeah, I forgot about it. Tommy Edmond. Oh yeah, that, Edmund, that, yeah that's probably the, yeah. He'll probably he's a good, he's a really good player, very underrated. Oh yeah. All right, let's get to it here. Uh, starting off here from rookie card of White Sox player Nick Matagro. 
Next rookie card here is from the A's, James Caprielian. Rookie card, and it has my little, my little trophy here, Mr. Alec Baum. Future stars, Gavin Lux. Um, Rysel Iglesias, I believe now an angel, if I remember correctly. I believe he's the pitcher that went over there. We have Max Kepler. Luke Voigt. Johnny Cueto. Clayton Kershaw. Mitch Haniger. Oh, gosh, I'm slinging cards here. Uh, we have the Washington Nationals <coughs> team card here. We have a Chicago White Sox team card here. And post game hand wash, clean hands needed here in <laughs> the year. And to close it out, we have uh, is Cody Hewer. All right. Yeah, pretty underwhelming back to end it. Sorry. Definitely right. not, not walk yeah. off or anything. I, bl I blame you. Yeah, you okay. should. <laughs> I feel like I whiff like Reggie. All right, so my my high card is the Javi Baez at three twenty two. Oh, jeez. Mine is a uh, Tristan McKenzie at three nineteen. So my yeah, okay. I knew that was a high one, but I didn't know if it was high enough. Uh, sorry, I'm going through this really fast. And not three eighteen Chicago White Sox. Wow, Michael, what the I get the win. five? Yeah, the big comeback. Yep. All right, so let me let me do this in the background real quick. So that was five points, thirty six. Angelo, thirty one. Wow. Okay, so let's uh, let me share this. Yeah, get the camera off me. <laughs> <laughs> I'm like, what am I supposed to do? Am I supposed to do some tricks? Come on. There we go. All right. So let's. Um, all right. So here it is. So. Actually, it says 48. So I actually messed up somewhere here. But, um, well, you don't have enough. You don't have a one. Oh, the one is the, uh, sorry. Yeah, the one's the wild card. The 49. This is actually 48. So I mean, we're, I don't know why we let's see. I'll have to recalculate this. But I mean, this is pretty close. So 126. Yeah, technically. Well, I mean, that put me in first place, actually. So, I we're missing one point here. So it, it, yeah, it, I, I guess it, it wouldn't swing it very much. But I'll I'll go through right. and and uh, recalculate that. Um, Regardless, you're in first place, sir. Yeah, that's that's insane. Um, yeah, Angela was was definitely that. Way. Uh, although this is odd because it's um, yeah, his doesn't match up. Does it? Is that what's going on? I think it's 122, uh -oh. 120. It would be what? Yeah, it would be 126. So I, I'm missing. I'm missing one point, one, one, one place. So I'll definitely recalculate that. And uh, I'm gonna, He's gonna recalculate to make sure he has his lead. Well, there's one. There's one point missing somewhere. So I'll definitely uh, recalculate that, and I will definitely update you. But that, I mean, how much fun is that to do that every so every week? We definitely. Um, yeah, did you did you you didn't get a uh, relic or an autograph, Nothing. Kevin? Nope. So. Nope. Uh, Remaining. So are we going to throw all of those into our, um, our pack or, uh, how are we going to do, how are we going to do this? Do no, we, we have to figure that out. Cause I still have, you got to figure that out. Cause we still have like seven, four, packs four, five, seven, five, six, okay. Seven. I so maybe I got, I got eliminated for one round. So I have eight left. So we'll, we'll do, we'll do regular, uh, next week. Um, okay. and get back to some trivia, get back to some, uh, this day in trivia. baseball because we're getting closer to the season. So that's going to be uh, a lot of fun. And uh, so, yeah, so let, that's, uh, let's see. Let me do this real quick. Yeah, that's always a lot of fun. I mean, what? I mean, I love like racking up the points. I mean, I'm like it's blowing like, up from opening all these. Like, whoo, there's, a lot, <laughs> there's a lot going on here. Yeah. But I've had like almost two pints. So I'm like, all right. Oh, good. look at you. <laughs> so, yeah, if you'd like to um, support us, uh, check out our Patreon. It is the end of the month, so I would suggest uh, doing it at, if you're going to support us on Patreon. Wait Monday. D yeah, do it. Do it on on the first. That way, you're just billed for the the month. Um, we definitely appreciate all your support there. Uh, check out our eBay store. We just have a couple of things up, um, and uh, I'm going to have some more stuff uh, up uh, coming coming up in the in the next couple of weeks. We have our Etsy store. 
Um, we've been having people go on there and get some of the, uh, the coasters. Uh, Angela has some in the background. We have some stickers and, and magnets and stuff like that. And I always uh, throw in some uh, some cool stuff in there um, that's uh, kind of unique. Uh, so yeah, so check that out. We definitely appreciate all your support. Check us out here. We're on Twitter, Facebook, Instagram, YouTube, and Twitch. Anything you can do, spread the word. We appreciate your help so much. Um, this has been a great endeavor. I can't believe we've gone, what, well, 43 but 44 episodes with the pilot. Yeah, uh, yeah we're quickly approaching one year of, of straight of doing this, and it's been a blast. So, uh, Angelo, uh, do you have anything you want to promote? Yeah, a couple things. So, uh, thank you guys for uh, tuning in here today. Thank you guys for tuning in to uh, Beer and Break with Angelo. We actually have episode three. Uh, dropping on Saturday uh, at 9 a.m. So make sure you stay tuned for that. Um, also, uh, I started uh, live streaming on Facebook Live every Monday, uh, doing a random uh, pack opening. So uh, this Monday uh, on my personal Facebook, Angelo Trinidad at Facebook, I'll be uh, opening these three uh, solo packs of 2020 Tops Fire. So uh, come hang out, check it out, and um, and uh, just doing a random pack opening on, on a Monday night. And that's on my personal Facebook at Angelo Trinidad and uh, coming soon uh, will be uh, the first ever wifey pack wars. So <laughs> I got my wife, uh, Allie to agree to do uh, pack wars with me. So we'll be kicking it off here soon with the video. So stay tuned to the channel for that. And if you uh, don't see me on here, you can f find me on the Twitch stream of at big teach 45 playing Call of Duty Warzone Monday through Friday, 8 p.m. Pacific Standard Time. Fantastic. Kevin. All right. Well, you can find me on Instagram and Twitter at Lock and Lowell. That's L-O-K-N-L-O-L-L. -L -L -L. Or I, I'm going to be a broken record. Scratch. Repeat. Uh, support your local minor league baseball team. Support your local brewery. Support your local business, please. We want them to stick around. And... Oh, yeah. And if you like Amazon, shop at Amazon, look up beerbaseball.com slash affiliates. Find the bookmark there. Find the, I'm sorry, find the Amazon page. Bookmark it, buy it a little bit, comes back to us. Thank you, guys. Yeah. Uh, Ed, Ed knows how it goes. Uh, wife always wins. <laughs> okay, you got to win. I'm like, I mean that's, her. Well, hey, that's, the, the, that's the, the cheat code. Yeah, the, the viewers are going to vote. The viewers are going to vote. Spoiler alert. So I'm going to leave yeah. it up to you guys on who wins the pack wars. Who I'm, not voting, so. <laughs> I'm not voting for you. Yeah, that's fine. I'd vote, I'd vote for her every day of the week anyway. <laughs> um, yeah. And uh, I, I was thinking too, I mean, I just had this thought we should actually uh, maybe quickly profile a minor league baseball team every yep. episode. Maybe we could do that and give you the uh, opportunity to know uh, these uh minor league baseball teams a little bit better and go straight to their store. I mean, that's what we do. We, we research that Kevin, uh, maybe you can, uh, in the background, give me one that you you're, I mean, you have the, what, what is the one that, that you're, you're wearing? Well, this is the Akron rubber ducks. Akron rubber ducks. I went all Indians today. Cause I got the major league shirt and went, this is the Akron rubber ducks. They're about an hour South of, uh, Cleveland, uh, double a farm team for the Indians. I don't believe that changed, uh, in the course of everything that's, with the realignment of minor league baseball. Yeah. Albert Bell want, want play for them, right? I want to say yes. I don't remember yeah. they were. I don't remember at that point they were called Canton or Akron because they're both pretty, they're both pretty close to each other. Gotcha. Gotcha. So maybe we can profile something yeah, real quick fine. and then just say, hey, go check them out. Absolutely. Um, I think that'd be fun. And we yeah. definitely should promote that. So thank you so much for joining us. We won't see you at the brewery. We won't see you at the baseball field. But who knows? It's a brand new year. And uh, things are changing quickly, so maybe we will. Uh, but we will see you here every Tuesday, uh, 6 p.m. Pacific, 9, 9 p.m. Eastern. Thank you for joining us. We enjoy uh, doing this for you, and uh, we'll see you next week. Good night, everyone. Peace.